Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, man. Um, just want to respond to a video that Ticket TV uh, put out uh, earlier. Great video, man. And me and him on the same page except on one thing about why Floyd, you know, might be cooning because he trying to basically went over the judges possibly for a second fight with Manny Pacquiao. Well, you know, he trying to secure a victory. Basically, he trying to make sure he don't get get fucked over in a second fight with Manny Pacquiao. Look, uh, me and the subs, Ticket and a few other people, we see the writing on the wall, man. I think if Floyd comes back, he's going to get fucked. And the funny part about it is... Nobody's going to probably feel sorry for Floyd if it does happen. Because, like I say, Floyd turned his back on the very people that were supporting him, man. And it is what it is. I hope it doesn't happen because I respect Floyd as a fighter. The person, that is a different story. But if Floyd is doing that cooning for a victory or cooning to secure a fair victory, then... Maybe Floyd shouldn't come back if he think that's going to happen to him. If he think he's going to get fucked over by the judges, then he shouldn't come back. But here's the thing. I think they're going to try to fuck Floyd over no matter what. I mean, they let him get away with the, the Berto fight because, look, it was Andre Berto. But people still feel sorry for Pacquiao for some strange reason, you know. And it just goes to show you how these races get down. You know, Floyd's an American citizen, but they're really root for a motherfucker who really don't put no money into the US, USA. All he do is come here, fight, and take his ass back to the Philippines. I mean, tell me in my life. But at the end of the day, it's his money. He can do whatever the fuck he want to do with it. You know? And Manny Pacquiao, just like Floyd, he has a very shady past. But people seem to for, forgive him, but you you know, black people, they can't forgive us, you know, because that's how, how these cave demons get down. You know, they think they're better than everybody, and, they, and they're not. But the issue with Floyd is, if this happens to Floyd, if he fights Manny Pacquiao, and he dominates Manny Pacquiao, and he doesn't get the, get the nod... And he started hollering that, oh, they just didn't want a black man to break Rocky Marciano's record. People going to be like, hey, Floyd, ain't nobody trying to hear that. Because when we was taking up for you and saying that a lot of the criticism you get is because you black, then you going to turn around and shit on, on the very people that was like riding for you. Just like Cam Newton, just like Cam Newton, he like stuck in the middle of nowhere. Because he wanted to say that that the reason why he don't get the calls that other people, other quarterbacks get is because he black and they white. Well, like I said, if he wouldn't have, you know, started cooning, then, you know, he would have been all right. He would have had people riding for him. He would have had me and Ticket, LBZ, 7-8, blood riding for this motherfucker. But he basically, you know, gave us the finger. So we giving this, this dude the finger back. And we doing the same thing with Floyd. So, if he get fucked over in a rematch with Manny Pacquiao, ain't nobody gonna feel sorry for him. This is fact. And I just gotta keep it 100 on that shit. Now, at the same time, like I said before, I'm not gonna be rooting for Manny Pacquiao if there is a second fight. I'm damn sure gonna be rooting for Floyd. That's just how I roll. I don't, you know what I'm saying? If I call myself becoming a bandwagon Manny Pacquiao fan, flip-flopping just because I have an issue with Floyd, that make me just as bad as Floyd. You know what I'm saying? That make me a coon. And I don't get down like that. So, nah, I, I, I just can't roll like that. But hopefully... Floyd doesn't come back. I don't want to see Floyd come back. To be honest with you, he has nothing to prove. And he shouldn't be fighting just for money. Floyd then made more than enough money. And like I said, his 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 lust for money is gonna be his downfall. 
in the ring. I wouldn't come back. I wouldn't come back. But at the end of the day, the decision is up to Floyd. But all I'm seeing of Floyd Mayweather, man, if you get fucked over, man, don't, like I say, don't look to us. Don't look to us to have your back. Because at the end of the day, like I said, people want to see this dude lose. And I think they setting him up for failure. Because I'm telling you something, man. That motherfucker Floyd lose. Shit. I think some I think some of these damn YouTube channels going to shut their channel down. Because they going to feel their work is complete. Floyd need to understand motherfuckers don't like him. They hate him for whatever fucking reason. And by him sitting up there barking like a dog and catering to, this, to a certain group... That's, like I said, that's going to be his downfall. I'm going to tell you right now, he lose to Manny Pacquiao, whether he dominate Manny Pacquiao and he don't get, get the nod, or if he do lose to Manny Pacquiao, if he get beat, if he get outboxed, or if he get knocked out. I'm telling you, the world going to fucking celebrate, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm keeping it 100. They will fucking celebrate. You will hear Skip Bayless and that drunk white bitch Michelle Beto talk so much shit till it won't even be funny because they will feel like it's a victory for them you will see all these racist ass cave demons making videos talking shit saying yeah Floyd finally lost they don't care whether Floyd dominates the fight and he gets cheated they won't care about that because Floyd will have a L on his record so with that being said, man, this is buyer beware for uh, Floyd, man. If you want to sit up there and let and, and fight for for money when you really don't need no more money, and then you fuck around and, and, and get screwed in a fight, yeah, you may leave with a uh, hundred and fifty, two hundred million dollars, or however much they're gonna probably pay you for a re a rematch. You still gonna have an L on your record, and I think that's gonna bother, and I think that will bother Floyd more than any amount of money he have if he have an L on his record. I think it would bother Floyd, but we never know. Maybe Floyd, this fight, he gonna go in there and he gonna try to knock Manny's ass out. You never know, but we shall see. I'm out.